What's up everybody, Flaming Kong here, welcome back to Donkey Kong 64 last time. We got very close to completing Frantic Factory, this time we're gonna complete it, for sure. Well, that's a lie. I'll try my best. Eh, of course I fell literally immediately. What a way, what a way of doing things. That just occurred. <laughs> that was so... I shouldn't be. Sh I should not be surprised at all. So, all right, let's warp. Let's try that again. Yay! I get to do this again. We're gonna be kind of doing the same platforming over and over. You know, until we get it. Let's wait for this. As you can see, there's 10 bananas right there. We only need 10 more, so we already know where they all are. See? Fantastic, right? And even better, there's the last banana for Diddy. Now we're done with Diddy and... Um... Uh, Lanky. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot who we had already finished. All right. Um, no wait. Let's do Tiny first. This Tiny's is up here. We also have. I don't know if we can get it from down. If I tried very hard, I might be able. To. No. Well. Actually, nope. We'll get that very soon. I think that's almost the last banana. Yeah, this will be 80. I know, I'm missing five somewhere. Huh. That's not good. Anyway, for this, we use the banana. Oh, it's over there. Okay, well, we'll get this first. Then we'll twirl over there and grab that. For this one, you have to shoot the golden banana before it disappears. You have to be very, very fast. And if you shoot a Kong, you lose, I think, right away. Something like that. I don't know. Maybe. But I did it flawlessly. That gets a lot more difficult. You have to, like... <laughs> when it gets really, like, close, like, the last ones, I had to, like, stay after each one so that I knew where it was going to appear and just already have my cursor there. I don't really know how they expect you to do that, but they totally do. Like, I'm not crazy. They, they definitely expect you to just do that. Which is so strange to me. Alright, before we fall back down there. Okay, can you... Could you? Maybe. Thank you. You wanna... Twirl on over here. Now we need Donkey Kong. And get his almost last thing, kind of. His blueprint. No. No! Fucking hell. Why? Why me? I didn't ask for this. Now, guess what? We have to do that platforming section again. Wow. Great. Alright, well, while we're here, let's just get the last thing for Tiny Kong. We have these. But, more importantly, we have her banana, which we... We definitely can get from right here. Sure of it. Yes. Now we only have Donkey Kong and Chunky Kong to complete. Like I said, this will be very fast. We probably- we could have done this last episode if I just made last episode like a little bit longer. And I was fluent with my game. Not making mistakes every three seconds. It is what it is. Alright, we already got back. Now we just have to do this platforming section correctly. Uh, 
that was... Alright, now. Time for this. I recommend destroying him. Like that. And then... There we go. Alright, we got it. Now we have everything. We have everything for four of the Kongs, I believe. Let's just check real quick. Oh, I still have to do that. Yeah. Alright. Crap. I don't really want to do that. Before... Let's... Let's grab all of Chunky's bananas first. Because all those bananas are just literally right here. We'll do that first. Then we'll go grab his banana coins that are down there. And then we'll have all the colored bananas of the world, at least. Now, let's go down here, grab these. We don't have to grab all the banana coins, but it's better to grab them now rather than later, so you just don't even have to worry about banana coins later on in the game if you collect a lot of them earlier on. Because then you'll just have enough for pretty much everything. So I get them all? I got them all. Alright, now... You can just go to the bottom. We have to hit Chunky Kong switch. Uh, make sure I'm... Alright, so... You want to... Rush over. Now you only get... What is it, like 10 seconds? 99... Do you get 99 seconds for this? Or maybe it's after you warp you get less time. No. They're very generous with this. Interesting. I didn't realize that. Well, they expect you to do it without the warp. Alright, so now we're just missing that one for Donkey Kong. Which... I'm not looking forward to doing, but we're gonna go do it, so... The warp to four... Ow. Um... Way out of the way. Then we warp to... I don't know. Where do we warp to next? Oh, uh, one? Yeah. And then three? I think that's right. That, that sounds right to me. Alright, now this is probably gonna take some editing here. I, I really don't think I'll be able to do this my first try. There's actually two things that we get for this. Can you move? This isn't the right place. Well, it sort of is, I guess, in a way. You just have to go up here. Okay. We go up here, and then warp. Then we'll be in the right place. I don't think that was the most ideal way of getting there, but I don't care. I got here. We're here. Alright. I'm not looking forward to this whatsoever. Let's do it. I am going to use a restore point at the beginning of this. Just to save time. That's literally all it is. So we're going to use a restore point. I promise I won't abuse this. I'm only going to use that at the beginning. Unless I start doing absolutely terrible. Then we'll see how it goes. Do, 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 do. So this is the original Donkey Kong. Oh look, it has my... Does it actually... I think those are my scores. My other save file. So they carry over. That's interesting. Alright, so... We're Jumpman, Mario.
First level, 25 meters, not too bad. You know? Oh, crap. And there we go. Nice. You know what? I am gonna do a restore point after. Because I don't wanna I don't wanna mess it up. That's it. That's all I, that's all. So judge me if you want. You also can see what date I'm recording this. It's uh it's actually being recorded for the finale of Super Mario Odyssey. Just cause. Um I'm still grinding. I know it are it already should be happening for you, I think. So yeah, 50 meters, pretty easy. 75 meters is where it uh, gets gets tricky here. Sorry about the restore points. This is purely to save time. So far we haven't messed up though, so... Speaking of... <laughs> we're not going to abuse them, I promise. We're only doing it for this, because this isn't the main game, you know? Like, this is, like, this is another game in a side of game. This isn't what I signed up for, guys. How did that kill me? See? This is why we have restore point. Because if you lose, then you have to start all the way back over. And I do not, I don't want that. How does that kill me? Really? What? That seems strange to me. <laughs> I feel bad to keep abusing this, but... There we go. If you're very fast, you can jump right onto there. Alright, um... That's difficult. See, 75 meter is, in my opinion, the, the most difficult one. 100 meter is also pretty difficult. But 75, I just, I don't understand what you're supposed to do, pretty much, is what I'm saying. Like, I don't get it. Because, like, you can see where they fall. Alrighty. That's very tight there as well, in the 75 meter. Alright, we're at the very top. Now, I am going to edit this, because there's an extra thing that you get just for playing through it again. <laughs> And I don't think you guys care about seeing the, the thing again. You know what, I'll, I'll, I'll add that back onto the end. I'll add that onto the end of the... Or I can just start the next episode with that. That also works. We'll do that. Go down. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Yes. Perfect. Stay away from me. Just gotta keep watching where everything is. Alright, cool. We only had trouble with 75 meters, the rest we were fine with, so that's great. See, I'll do the next part of it. I'll cut to the next part. Alright, we'll do our name real quick. F. Okay. Not my best score, but that's fine. I wasn't going for score. I was going for gold banana. And now I think Squawks is going to appear here. And tell us. Yeah. 
clock. Now you've warmed up, how about trying to win a unique special prize by completing it again? Just two coins to play again. Four. So yeah, they make you pay banana coins, which is another reason I'm going to be using and abusing restore points. And it's a, it's a slightly more difficult version. It's not the most difficult, but it's slightly more difficult. So yeah, we'll do that next time. But for now, I'm just going to throw bananas at this hippo. We'll take on the boss, because that's all we have to do. All we have to do is throw bananas at a hippo. Like, it's that simple, guys. Like, come on now. It's pretty clear what we have to do. Um, and we're going to use Tiny, because Tiny is the one that you do this... Maybe Tiny is the third Kong then, because you do use Tiny for the third boss. So maybe... Maybe it is Tiny. Because I know the first five bosses you use the first the five different Kongs. And then the sixth boss you use Donkey Kong. And the seventh boss you can use all Kongs. So. And eighth boss it's also all of them. So. Yeah, I don't know. Um, before doing this, before doing this boss, make sure you have the hair twirly ability. If you don't have that, I think it's still doable. I don't know if it is or not. But the hair twirly, I, I've never done it without it. I, I would definitely recommend you just do that. Alright, so we want to go in the shining square. This is a very, it's, it's what? It's when I think the bosses start to get difficult. Like, the first two bosses were not that bad. I'd say this is, like, the first difficult boss. It's not too bad, but it's kind of... It's kind of bad. It's kind of scary as well. I don't know his official name. I think it's, like, Jack. Just Jack in the box. So I think his name is just Jack. I don't know. He sounds like Donald Duck. It's like an evil Donald Duck. But pretty much he's gonna follow you and you want to twirl. Yeah, I feel like you need the twirl here. So make sure you have the twirl. I recommend twirling in the middle. I think that's the most... Alright, so now you want to look around for any pop... And yeah, he's gonna be throwing stuff at you. Alright, let's over here. There we go. So you want to go to the one that's corresponding. The, the color of the switch doesn't matter. It's the color of the um, the platform that they're standing on. So he was standing on a white platform, so you want to hit the switch that's on the white platform. That gets difficult because he like shoots fi fireballs at you like that, and he shoots laser beams later on. And it can knock you off, and it'll make you restart the entire cycle. There we go. So that's two hits down. I think there's four total hits. It might be five. It's a it's a, it's a lot. It's more than it's more than three. I know that much. It might be four. If it's not four, it's five. I don't think it's more than five. Yeah, this boss isn't very easy. It's gonna end, I think, now? No. Now. Uh... There it is. And that's what I meant. Because once he hits you off... He starts moving around again. So... That's what I meant by you don't want to fall off. But I had a feeling I'd fall off. I was not expecting to not fall, is what I should be saying. I thought there was a chance I might not, but I'm not surprised. There's a way of being more strategic with it, I was just being very... There we 
is it? Oh gosh. I don't think I'm gonna get to it in time. Nope. That's another thing is you have to be quick enough. I just didn't see where the switch was. But yeah, like I said, this boss is not easy. It's not at all. And it's gonna get more difficult actually. This is I know for sure there's another hit after this because he hasn't done something that he does. I don't know if it's one more or two more. Oh gosh. Alright, I see it. There we go. That's three. Now does he go invisible? He didn't go in Oh, did he? No, he didn't. Which means it's five. This isn't the last one then. <laughs> Cause he goes invisible. And he didn't yet. So there's definitely one more hit after this then. Well dang. I told you guys this is difficult. Oh, he's gonna do the laser beam. Okay. I got him first. Alright. Now he's gonna go invisible. This is the last hit. Alright. So it's five hits. And pretty much with this one, you just have to follow the what's lighting up. Or the sparkles. Alright. Uh, is it gonna end now? No. No, still not ending. Alright, he's on the way. I don't see any switch. You guys see a switch? Dang it! See, it's hard to not fall off. Oh, gosh. He's on white, now blue, now white, now blue, now white, now blue, now white, now blue. The first time I played through this game, I actually got a game over on this site. I might, it might have been in my let's play that I did. Damn it! Damn it! He shoots them too slowly. Come on. That was bullshit. Oh no. Well. Fantastic. Three more tries without falling. Or getting hit. For that matter. To kind of avoid both. That would have been so good because it was close too. Damn it. Uh. I told you guys, this is not, not an easy fight. I'd say the next boss is easier. It's only if you know the controls to it, though. Ne the next boss, it's not, like, difficult. It's just, you have to, like... Uh... I don't even know how to say it. No! I jumped! That was impossible to dodge. That was so dumb. Where is he? He's very close. Two more tries. Gosh, I've... It's been a while since I've done this bad on this boss. I don't know what's going on. I, I know I said the boss was difficult, but I didn't mean this difficult. It's not like it's the most difficult boss in the game. Where the fuck is it? Damn it, you! This didn't take damage. God. Okay. 
I can't. This boss is. This is why I left so much room open for this boss. Is so that, you know, I do, I I wanted to not have much going on before this because I had a feeling the possibility for it taking forever was possible. This might be the longest boss fight other than the final boss. Okay, well. That, there I just got lucky. And we finally beat it. That took forever. If we would have done that in one cycle, it would have been like at least five minutes shorter, right? It would have been a lot shorter. No doubt. Alright, well, we got the key. Doesn't matter. Now, we don't actually have the cash in this key right now. We can save time by just not doing it immediately. And we have all of the bananas, at least. And gold bananas. We, we have everything except for the special coin you get for doing that. Which I'll be coming back in my own time to do. So... Might as well, might as well go, oh, we can do this, chunky monkey, you have tiny's person, oh, okay, well, we got tiny's blueprint for the DK Isles, that's pretty nice. We also have the banana fairy for the decals. It's also nice. I didn't get it. Damn it. Banana fairy. What's interesting about um about this game is I think the the I think the fifth I think I think the seventh world besides the bonus levels I think the seventh world is actually pretty easy. It's hard to explain why. Um, maybe it's just because I don't have a good explanation. I don't know. But, let's go. I think Chunky has... Well, I know he has something. Uh, he has... It's like something along... Along here. I'm pretty sure he, he has like a... Pineapple one somewhere here. I thought he did. Maybe I'm wrong. I guess it's possible. Is that a pineapple? I was right. Okay, dude. Like, seriously, man, why'd you have to do that? Oh, banana. Also, we have 50 golden bananas. Nice. That's a lot of bananas. I think you need 30 to end of World 4. It's either 30 or 40. I mean... I, I don't know, 40 seems like a lot. I feel like it's probably not 40. This is also a lot of people's least favorite world of the game, because it's the water world, and just water worlds, ten people tend to just not like them, because they're water worlds. Like, why would you like them? Hey, okay, really? Just gonna let this guy keep hitting me? Hello? Alright, so we have the blueprint for... It is 30. Alright, well... Great. There's other things around. Like, uh... Tiny's barrel there. Can we even do the thing with Tiny? I don't know if we can even do the thing with Tiny yet. Let's just try it. Okay, what? 
There's no... There's no I, I don't see a reason to start the... The world right now. You know? It's kind of... Yeah, we might have to press chunk that chunky switch before we can do this, but I don't... Might as well try. Yeah, the gate's closed. Well, maybe I can slip through, who knows. <laughs> Just glitch through. That'd be funny. Nope. Alright. Yeah, I need the chunky switch first. At least I know now. That won't be bothering me. You know what? I'll enter Gloomy Galleon. Because why not? I think we have enough to get all the power-ups, too. This is a world that I don't know I'll be 100%ing right off the bat. I- I- I don't know. Gloomy Galleon, I don't- I think I like it more than a lot of people do, but I still don't like it very much. It's definitely, I'd say, the least popular world. Especially compared to the next three worlds after this, which are usually considered the favorite three. The last three worlds, well, sort of last three. The eighth world is kind of strange in how it works. There's, there's seven main worlds. Then there's an eighth world. But anyway. We're here, so. We got pineapples. Alright. You got blue bananas. Okie dokie. We got purple bananas over here. Yeah. Nice. Hey. Purple bananas, but a coconut gun? What the heck? Hey, purple bananas over here too. These guys are called... Oh crap, what are they called? They're called something. Did I miss a banana? It does not give me nine. You've gotta be kid. They can't do that to me. They can't do that to me. That's evil. Nine? Really? You can actually get Tiny's, um... Where is this? I, where am I? I'm on top of the ship. Um, where do I even want to go here? I think this, we need, yeah. We need big boy Chunky to get in there. Yeah, there's Cranky Labs, right? Cranky's Lab right here. It's interesting. <laughs> 15 banana medals? Do I not have 15? Oh, I guess I wouldn't. I mean, does that mean you don't have any new power-ups for me, dude? Not every world has a power-up for every Kong, so... That's fine. Hey, you. Yeah, you. You're dead. We already have Tiny's Blueprint. That's nice. Oh, crap. I fell. Darn it. Wow. I think we might have already gotten everything up here for her, but I'm just checking. Yeah. Okay. I don't know why I'm still playing, but I am. Just keep going, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Shit. 
should be able to kill both of them. Well, that didn't work. Can I see? Can you please see? Can you please let me see? Hello? Hello? What? Hello? What? Huh? There you go. <laughs> I don't even want... I don't even know. I have no idea. Alright, so if we break all of these open... One is a banana fairy. It's pretty nice. That upgrades all of our stuff. Has a banana in here for some reason. Or... That gives us music. Go banana. Let's call that a day. Sure. Actually, let's, let's break this thing over here first. Do I want to break it right away? Uh oh. Well, it's broken now. Yeah, I think that goes away for good. I'm not sure though. And we'll check Cranky's for Chunky. Why not? Because, like, there's no harm in it, right? Do you not have anything for me either? Is he not giving me any new power ups until I have 15 banana medals? I don't think so. Well, whatever. Alright. That's because they unlock at the same time, they don't give you- yeah, that's right. I knew that. I don't know why. I forgot. Okay. Next time on Donkey Kong 64, we're gonna keep exploring Gloomy Galleon. See you then. Bye.